movement on a bench press is easy. Whether you're using a barbell or dumbbells, all you have to do is lower the weight to your chest and push it back up. But I like to remember a cue to try to keep your shoulder blades tucked in your back pocket. That way as you push up, you're not pushing too hard with your shoulders and that putting too much stress on them. So keep your shoulder blades tucked all the way through the movement. Now if you were a professional bodybuilder trying to hit your chest, you would flare your elbows real wide, or if you're trying to hit your triceps, you'd tuck them real tight. But in general, for the average person, the more natural movement is going to be somewhere in between. And that's true for other upper body pushes, like a push-up. You don't want to flare your elbows out to the side and keep, or keep them tucked too tight. Find something that's comfortable and natural in between. If you were a professional power lifter, you'd want a real hard arch in your back as you go to bench so that you can lift as heavy a weight as possible. But since you're not, keeping a, no, a more neutral spine is generally going to be safer, lead to less injury, and actually work the right muscles that you want to work. And the same is true with other upper body pushes. Like a push-up, keeping a neutral spine is the way to go. That said, when you're lowering the weight on a bench press, if you have too flat of, uh, of a spine, if you don't have any arch at all, when you lower the weight, you could put too much stress on your shoulders by coming down too low. So having a slight arch can limit that range of motion, or you can just not lower the bar all the way to your chest. Either way is fine. So find what's comfortable and what works best for you. As for where to start, both push-ups and the bench press are super easy and scalable. Uh, Push-up, you can make easier by elevating your hands onto a bench or even the wall. Uh, but a bench press you can use as light a weight or heavy a weight as you want. So either one is fine, and in fact a good program will probably have a little bit of both throughout your week.